Welcome to Art Making Beyond Woo. My name is Jason. Yeah, the last couple of weeks have been uh, pretty interesting. I noticed one of the things that I do that may have may be of benefit to others. The benefits of having unfinished work on paper kind of uh, backlogging up a little bit. I take one of those unfinished pieces. You know, it has a little more atmosphere and grit and texture and things. So what's happening is that kind of allows me to then just focus on design, keeping in mind like just the proportions and relationship uh size relationships between the objects and so that's why there's a lot of those because those are a little easier to sling paint around on but yeah that's been kind of beneficial because then when I do have the time to like focus in more then uh, I grab one of those and mount it like pick one that's maybe calling to me a little bit more and Yeah, generally I find that in the next day or two, there's just more to work with. Not that it's necessarily easier to resolve that painting, but it definitely like opens, it opens up more possibilities for me to then focus on like in the design and in the objects, what kind of marks what kind of mark making do I want to bring in? All the little nuances. See how those fit in more from a design standpoint, which is a large part of my background, so that's where I'm more comfortable. That's been kind of helpful, so I wanted to pass that along. That helps me gain ground. Generally when I land a painting like that, then it kind of charges me up and gives me a little more footing to move forward with some other paintings that I've had laying around. the oil cold wax and an encaustic um, man just loving how the colors all really like meld together and with these deep blues and the grays uh, with that encaustic it just so much depth into the piece um, a really nice outcome after the wax and everything kind of sets then you can go back in and like carve into it making marks and carving shapes into it and different things or even while it's um, not fully dry yet which is also cool really i want to see how how cleaner i can get with it so yeah i um, looking forward to that the other thing i found really fun was working in a size dimensionally that i just I uh, wouldn't have normally done. I happened to run across this canvas. Somebody was just <laughs> yeah, tossing it away in the garbage, so I, was, I swooped it up. And it had all this texture on it, um, and it was done proper. Uh, I forget the artist's name, but... And it's really heavy-duty, like, stuff. So, yeah. Uh, I grabbed that, and I had been kind of just playing around with it for, well, I don't know, weeks, really. Just in between other things. Um, and then that's when I threw all that collage on, which is really just the best way for me to disconnect from what's there so that I can just come back in and explore it fresh. I really like how it came out overall, because uh, then once I got color down and pushing more marks that I make, pushing those in, uh, man, yeah, I just really like how it came together. It feels really good. I'm really happy with the outcomes. There has been some exciting progress uh, on other fronts. I've been collecting a ton of textures as I've been making these different paintings over the last couple of years. So I've curated the best textures um, from the last couple of years and then I put all that into a pocket reference book. 
And then the other one is more of a coffee table book. That'll have more the finished pieces that I'll be exhibiting in the next year or so. Really happy with how that's coming out too. It's it's almost done. I need another few pages of writing and I'm not the quickest writer. <laughs> so yeah, that's uh, that's been what's up. Thank you very much for joining me on this Art Making Beyond Woo episode. My name is Jason. I do wish you the very best on your art making journey. So if you're into all this crazy art making stuff, let me know what you guys think in the in the comments below. Thank you for joining me this episode. Please do like and subscribe and feel free to uh, check out the website. Thanks again for watching Art Making Beyond Woo.